We had just an absolutely overwhelming response. The public were happy to see us back in town. They, they couldn't wait to ride us. It, we are kind of a hit here locally. The Southern Michigan Railroad Society's train pulled into Tecumseh on Saturday, marking their return after shutting down last year due to the pandemic. Dozens of people took advantage of the chance to catch a ride once again. Oh, it was, it was wonderful, yeah. I mean, it was short, but yeah, it was a very nice ride. So, Kirsten here enjoyed it. A $20 ticket takes you from Kenton to Tecumseh in a living piece of history. For over 40 years, this train has been a fixture of these communities. But that all came to a halt last year. By the time we had started uh, preparing uh, for the summer season, COVID had already taken place. The railroad had no choice but to shut down, losing their only source of income in the process. All our operating expenses are covered by ticket sales and member donations and member dues. And obviously not running for one full year was, it made it difficult. However, the society managed to stay on track. They had enough money in reserve to keep the business afloat and even took advantage of the downtime. Specifically, the society used the time off to refurbish a car, clean the entire train, and repair railroad tracks like these. With the repeal of Michigan's COVID restrictions, the Southern Michigan Railroad is riding the rails again, with scheduled rides on the second and fourth weeks of July and August. Now all ages can once again enjoy the fun of train travel. Six years of being here, I've discovered that everybody's a railroader at heart. Reporting in Tecumseh, Michael Sandlin, WTOL 11.